minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. We have RD-180 ignition and we have liftoff of the United Launch Alliance Atlas V rocket carrying the NRO L-61 mission for the National Reconnaissance Office. The PO has gone to close loop control. Hard to maybe chamber pressures are good at this point. So many chamber pressures are rolling off. Pitch program is complete. Boosters throttle down, right on schedule. Roll program is complete at this point. SRB burnout. And we have SRB burnout. Signatures look good. Booster has throttled back to full thrust. RD-180 continues to perform well. Booster is now 50% of its liftoff weight. Coming up on SRB jettison. And we have indication of jettison of two solids. Signatures look good. Closed loop steering has been enabled. Small body rates at this point in time. And booster is throttled back, right on schedule. Again, RD-180 signatures look very good. And we have indication of the RCS pyro valve firing. That system is now pressurizing the flight level. Signatures look good. Current altitude is 42 miles, downrange distance 86 miles, current velocity 6,137 miles per hour. RD-180 continues to perform well, pump speeds look good. Booster is now 25% of its liftoff weight. Booster engine continues to perform well. Currently flying at 5 Gs. It's throttling to maintain that. Boost phase cooldown is underway. And we have begun to throttle for to 4.6 Gs in preparation for BECO. Boost phase cooldown is complete. And we have BECO. Engine shutdown looks good. And we have indication of stage separation. We have locks and fuel pre-start underway. GN2 purge firing of the RCS. And we have ignition and full thrust on the RL-10. And we have indication of payload fairing jettison. Looks like a clean separation. 